Our one-week vacation in Gran Canaria continues. We are staying in the oasis garden surrounded by high mountains. We've been observing them every day and today it's the time to experience them. Of course, as always with us, it will be an adventure. Just not sure if a positive or a negative adventure. It's very windy, very foggy, but definitely something we won't forget. Today we would like to go to the mountains there. As you can see, it's quite cloudy. And on the biggest mountains there in the distance, there is a big cloud barrier. So they are in the fog, in clouds, and the conditions are not the best. But they are never the best, it looks like. We are quite unlucky with the weather, so we are going there anyway and we'll see what happens. We are getting closer to the mountains and they look majestic. Absolutely love the views, but you can still see the cloud barrier on top of them, so it doesn't look the best for us but we are still going. We were driving higher and higher and we appeared in this pretty little village that was along the way. As we drive through this quaint village, you'll notice the traditional Canarian buildings, creating a very nice atmosphere. It's a peaceful oasis where visitors can immerse themselves in the beauty of rural Gran Canaria. San Bartolomé de Tirajana is a popular destination for all the cyclists who start at the Atlantic Ocean and ride many kilometers up the valley. It's a lot of elevation gain. San Bartolomé de Tirajana is also surrounded by stunning natural landscapes, offering breathtaking views of the surrounding mountains and valleys. But our journey didn't end here we still had quite a lot of elevation gain ahead of us. Tommy had to stay alert because of all the motorbikes that were driving everywhere around us. The mountains were so close at that moment and the weather was turning grey. We were entering the world of clouds and fog. Of course, Tommy wasn't very amused as it was starting to drizzle. But finally, it looked like we were getting close to our starting point. Just a little bit higher and we were there. We're starting another day in the mountains. It's foggy here, but it looks like the sun is trying to shine at least a little bit on us. So wish us some sun rays soon, please. Mm -hmm. Yes, we want them, but we are not very hopeful. <laughs> quite cold here, maybe around 8 degrees Celsius and we can hear the wind blowing in the trees up there. Luckily here in the forest we are kinda shielded, so it's a bit better and we are walking uphill, so we are getting warmer, our bodies, that's nice in this weather. Peter's we body at least. <laughs> Yeah, Tommy's body is not very well regulated in various extreme temperatures. Either too cold or too hot, right? Mm -hmm. And it wasn't my idea to come here, by the way. Yes. It's colder here than in the Czech Republic. So Tommy is not very impressed. <laughs> yeah, that's not why I booked a vacation in Gran Canaria. Yes, but I want to see everything, so... I want to experience the mountains and the forest as well. It's kinda sunny. Something kinda. <laughs> something is happening. So you are getting more and more impressed with this, right? <laughs> there are 
a lot of these plants along the way. We have no idea what it is, but it smells like menthol. <laughs> menthol? Yeah. Menthol. <laughs> Peppermint. I don't know, something like that. It's yeah. not our mint, <laughs> but it must be related, I guess. It's Gran Canaria mint. Mint or sage or something like that. The smell is really interesting. The views here are breathtaking. It was definitely worth it coming here. <laughs> it will get better. Look, always when we speak, the sun is trying to show up. Yeah, now we can see the fog better. <laughs> and now this appeared, so it looks like the fog is... Uh, I, I'm not saying that it's going away, but every now and then it's thinner. Yeah, now it's back again. <laughs> but there were two big rocks guys hmm. now they are gone now they are gone but they will appear again i'm sure this is very nerve-wracking it's cool how it's also raining around the trees it's very cool it yes adds to the atmosphere exactly I say. yes yes it totally adds to the atmosphere i love it so it's foggy windy cold and rainy mm -hmm. Yay! It's the perfect combination. Yuppie! We are almost there. Few more meters. It's very windy very foggy but we will make it at least it looks like it i can already see the peak wow but this is not easy Here, the highest peak of Gran Canaria, Pico de las Nieves. How high are we? 1947. 47, or sometimes they write 50. 1950 meters above sea level. That's higher than anywhere in the Czech Republic. Yes. Beautiful. We go back now. Soon. Look at the amazing views behind us and yay, I am happy we made it. Finally summer. Wow, yes, it feels very summery here, we recommend. That's why we came here. <laughs> but guys, I saw pictures on the internet and they were beautiful. You can see the whole island from here. They are popping up now on the screen and sunny conditions and gorgeous. It can be very different when we are in the cloud wall. You probably couldn't hear anything. It's the highest peak of Gran Canaria. So that's amazing, we made it. The conditions were extreme there. So now we can be proud of ourselves that we made it, even though there is a parking lot up there, but we hiked and it's very cold here, around five degrees Celsius here on the highest elevations. So it's time to go, bye. At least the views are better here. Yes. Wow. And it's sunny. But it's still cold. 
still cold, very cold. The wind is blowing, but it looks amazing here. I like it. At least some kind of a reward. Yes. This is Mirador Presa de los Hornos. Hornos? <laughs> Mirador Presa de los Hornos. <laughs> okay, sure. <laughs> and Mirador means views, right? Uh huh. So the views are breathtaking. And there in the clouds we can see Rock de Nuble. Rock and Nublo? Mm -hmm. Something like that. And it's a very popular enormous rock here where all the tourists go but not us because it's in the clouds and this is easier we are very cold and frozen to the bones so just a quick look here and we are going elsewhere Look at the sunshine ready, Tommy. This looks better, I think. It does. There's wow. Windy here. No. At least for now. And we are just a bit lower, but next to the cloud barrier, which is somewhere there, the clouds are stopping mm -hmm. there. The mountains are like a big barrier. So on this side of the massive of the mountains, it's sunnier and we are going because we are not done hiking yet. We want to hike in this sunny, warmer weather. Yes, and the views behind Tommy are breathtaking. We are going on that mountain. It's 1500 meters above sea level. We are now around 1200 or something like that. It's quite warm here, so it should be okay. We can be in vibrant colors now. And that's cool. This is the cloud wall I was talking about. Those mountains are really like a barrier and they block the clouds coming here. So just here and there a cloud comes, but the main part stays there, which is nice because we like sunny on these summer-like vacations. progress with our hike but we came to these views so we had to make a little detour yes views are always amazing wow it's really steep let's take a look but guys i'm just stretching my arm i'm standing far from the edge so just to give you a bit of vertigo and yay look at the mountains wow Oh my god, I love views. And up there is our peak where we are heading, so it's quite close. We'll be there any second now. We are. This is amazing. We are on top of the world. <laughs> wow. This is beautiful. <sighs> so much better than the highest peak of Ga Gran Canaria, right? Yeah. <laughs> Which is somewhere there in the clouds. Hidden. Hidden. But here we can see so much. We can so see. So many mountains. Yes, almost everything we can see here. Even the ocean. Even the ocean the Atlantic Ocean. This peak is called Moro de la Cruz Grande. Which means nose of the big cross. Oh! Big okay. cross nose. Uh -huh. Apparently. That's, that's cool. 
and it's 1529 meters above sea level and it feels great to be here because these views are stunning and I am I don't know I'm overwhelmed again yeah. Wow! I'm glad we ended up here after the disaster in the morning <laughs> Yes. So my mood is better again. <laughs> Yay! Yeah, feels much better to be here. this place. We've been here already for an hour or so and we don't feel like leaving. Yeah. It's sunny, it's not windy, so it's really pleasant here. There's nobody around the whole time. It's awesome. <laughs> and the views are amazing. Yeah. As you can see. Wow, the views are top notch. Yeah. It's so much better to experience mountains this way than in the fog and wind and very cold temperatures. <laughs> we prefer it this way. Can you imagine? Who doesn't, right? Who doesn't? <laughs> that mountain quite close from us is my favorite. It looks like, you know, this shape and it feels like dinosaurs or I don't know what could live there forgotten about the outer world because it's impossible to get there and to get down. So, okay, it's quite small, but in my imagination, it's bigger and it's like that. I like thinking about things like that. Let's go explore it. <laughs> no, we are done with hiking for today. Of course, we need to get back to our car, but no more peaks, no more mountains. The atmosphere in the pine forest was simply magical. The bird song was so vibrant. We captured it with our device, hoping to share the experience with you. Take a moment to immerse yourself in the tranquil ambiance, even if just for a little while. We are almost back to our car and we've been saying how beautiful this hike was, absolutely breathtaking. So this totally made up for the cold first half of the day when Tommy was not amused at all. At all. So this got better, right? Mm -hmm. Much better. Yeah. This was the reward at the end of the day as always. Exactly. <laughs> it's so interesting how our days always get better as they go on so that's great because we have always something to look forward to that's why we never want those days to end yes and they end by darkness when the sun is down we are forced to end our day then <laughs> we've made it back to our car just as the sun is setting look wow <sighs> That's a first, because every time we came to our car so far, it was already dark. Yes, <laughs> so we have something new again. We are getting more efficient every day. Mm-hmm, totally.